guys and welcome to good times with toby coon i'm your host toby coon hope you're all having an awesome day hope you're having an awesome week i know we continue to be at home but we gotta do our best to maintain ourselves you know in our sanities keep in touch with our friends our families hope you guys are still having an awesome week um, despite things as for myself just at home working from home but i'm thankful at least i can have that option man uh, people out there don't and i'm hoping that once this gets resolved people get back on their feet and you know, get back with everything going on well today i'm actually gonna go into a a game that was actually been talked about in the chat i actually kind of figured you know what let's go ahead and play this uh classic it's technically a classic we're gonna cover but it's been reintroduced in three different um styles three different uh, renditions so we are going to be doing afterburner so this version is actually going to be afterburner black falcon this was actually released on the psp and it was probably the only time it made its way to the psp and that was it after that but we'll get into that so without further ado let's go ahead and play afterburner black falcon for the psp all right, so Afterburner Black Falcon. This was released in March 20th, 20, uh, 2007 in North America. This, actually, this game was actually, of course, a 3D shooter. This was one of the only games from the Afterburner series that made its way into the uh, PSP. And, of course, it was exclusive to the PlayStation. This, is not, this was not anything related to the arcade or nothing in re relation to it. The plot is really basic. Uh, you're taking on a terrorist organization known as the Black Falcon. They basically paid plane jacked uh, 13 prototype fighter jets that were dubbed the Assassin for the CIA. And of course, um, you, know, you basically go up against these guys, and you could take, you could actually choose from three different uh, jets: the F-14D Tomcat, the F-22 Raptor, and the F-15E Strike Eagle. Each have their own plot twist and ending depending on which jet you choose and which route you choose. So pretty much it's going to be a treat for me. It's going to be a, a new type of game. I never got to play any of the Afterburners for like the, you know, higher consoles. So it's going to be pretty cool. So let's go ahead and get started. Let's go ahead and go straight into Black Falcon. Let's see what we're up against. Let's see if this is a truly a uh, hidden gem or if it's a dud. So that's what we're going to find out today. Sega. And Commander John Burton, Senior Officer in the United States of the Force Aviation Squadron, also known as Scramble Team. <clears throat> the Jeep Scramble Team puts the military's best fighter pilots and cockpits of the deadliest air guns on dangerous missions where speed is essential and failure is not an option. We are deployed at the President's discretion across all political and geographical boundaries, and our only mandate is that we get the job done. <clears throat> Afterburner. Nice, what an intro. That's pretty cool. Oh, 
All right, let's do it. Okay, let's be a new pilot. All right, gotta go select my name here real quick. Let's see if I can have enough letters and spaces. So, didn't expect to put a name already. Go ahead and play it at easy, because trust me, I don't know if I can do medium race. I haven't even played this version of it, so forgiveness this time around. It's like you hear be Billy Blaze, call sign Sonic, blood type A B, favorite jet the F 15 E Strike Eagle, Billy Sonic Blaze, cares about one thing speed in his hometown of. Petaluma, California. Sonic toned his skills and his need for speed on the local drag racing circuit. Recently got too slow, he switched to sports bikes. When sports bikes bored him, he became a pilot. Okay. Bull, Harrison Duke. Call sign Bull, blood type zero. Favorite jet, F-A-I-B-E, Super Hornet. Unquestionably the top Marine Corps, F-A- IB Flyer. Harrison Bull Duke is a great pilot, but strictly in the scramble team for the money and prestige it will bring him later in the private sector. Bull learned his call sign with his preference for solving problems with brute force and tendency to exaggerate the uh, truth. Bull was the verge of being thrown out of the Marines when his commanding officer had the brilliant idea of reassigning him to scramble team. Bull is classified as hype and he's your problem now. Colonel Forge gave Bull's mission to that combined suicidal bravado with ordnance overkill. Bull excited in these missions as a success, and his success soon attracted the attention of the military industry complex. Who began to contact him with shady propositions and lucrative opportunities? Shinsei Tomiko Rosalini. Call sign Shinsei. Blood type A. Favorite jet F 14D Super Tomcat. The Japanese word Shinsei translates roughly into perfect, and that's exactly what Tomiko is. She wants only to be respected for her piloting excellence and her leadership skills. Tomiko grew up in the Candania, Kand Katina, U.S. Navy Air Base of Okinawa, watching squadrons of F 14 fighters perform maneuvers. Upon return to America, she applied to Annapolis. It was one of the top graduating cadets. Driven to prove herself, Tomiko rose to her prominence in her squadron and was recruited by Commander Burton to the elite scramble team task force. Although given the opportunity to fly more modern jets, Tomiko prefer prefers a 14 Tomcat in part because of its balance of speed and firepower, and in part because it reminds her of her Navy pilot father. Note, note to make a secret that does involve getting perfect scores to impress scramble team leaders and facilitate her promotion to squadron leader. All right, cool. Oh, we got more on Billy, so we gotta finish him. While the Air Force, he set the world record for speed and F-15 and 15E F-22 Raptor and captured SUC-59 Firehound. Sonic joined Scramble Team and quickly made friends with his outspoken bull and attracted young woman with the call sign Diamond. Black Falcon leader Colonel Forge was one Sonic's flight instructor and taught him several techniques to tolerate high speeds and G-forces. Now Sonic is wrestling with his, his mentor and the messy breakup of Diamond. Note Sonic begins the game with the fastest plane and stupid objectives are often tied to completing missions in record time. Any more on Bull? Oh yeah. Notes on Bull's Super Hornet carries the biggest bomb and missile payload and secret missions have often require scoring the most cash kills. So I guess we'll go with Sonic. Let's try Sonic. Looks like a young, young, young Chris Jericho. Yeah. Nick Nevada, zero four hundred hours. Scramble Team Aviation Research Facility, code name Dreamland. Four hours ago, the experimental aircraft hangar at Broom Lake was compromised.
Bourgeois. A team of commandos breached the perimeter, killed a security guard, and entered the testing grounds. <laughs> the agents stole in 13 prototype jets. These fighters are faster than any aircraft in the sky. They can deliver a missile of any one any man sized target from two kilometers away. They are concluding the assassins. These blew over defense and green left Dreamland airspace at 0415 morning. The men who stole the these assassin jets are yet unidentified, but we have a good idea who they are. The leaders are formal C Colonel Robert Brody, call sign Forge. He has turned traitor and he intends to sell these assassin jets to terrorists and hostile governments. This must not have that must not happen. <clears throat> Your job is to track down those planes and shoot them down if necessary. Deny assets at all costs. You are the fastest pilot we have, Sonic. Over 20 world records in the F 15E Strike Force. Eight missions completed in record time. You have the talent to speed, and now you have the backing of the entire United States military. But the success of this mission rests on your shoulders alone. I know you were good friends with Colonel Brudy. And I know about your relationship with Diamond. Son, you better face facts. Your girl turned traitor and joined up with Black Falcon. So now you have to put aside your personal feelings and do your job. You are top pilot. Go get the bad guys. Yep, new data. Truly give it the need for speed soundtrack. Break. Oh, this control's gonna be a mess, but all right. All right, let's see what we can do. Can't think of what has happened. The squad in the top secret just has been stolen by the mercenary group Black Falcon. They're making contacts throughout the criminal and terrorist underworld, and we expect that they already have plenty of allies. Strap on your wings and get airborne. You are clear to use any weapons necessary to clear the skies of this scum. One is objective, destroy YT gunship, destroy two battleships, and destroy ten radar dishes. And one day I'll use that stealth bomber if I can. So let's use this Jagus. Yeah, why not? I don't got the cam, I don't got the funds to customize. Let's use the weirdest jet, huh? <laughs> White parachute max out your ammo. Alright, cool. Alright. We're under attack, scramble team engage. Gotta figure out how to shoot now. Greatest pilot there, so I'm gonna figure it out.
Let's see if we get a better balance. Maybe we're not meant to have that sweet audio. Okay, I got well, I got shot. Pilot here. I don't think I'm meant to fight jets of this caliber, but hey, I got one finally. Nice. Okay, how do we turn around, man? <laughs> It's a dog fight they want. It's a dog fight they'll get. We'll figure this out. So, where am I going in this whole mission? That little assassin. There we go. Yeah, not really good at this. <laughs> oh, I'd love to, trust me. I just went to a volcano. <laughs> I wonder if that's actually can be done if you're a real, real good fighter. I guess I'm on solo of the airplanes, but. Yeah, I'm scrambled bed. <laughs> Whatever's going on, it's gonna go with it. This doesn't have a good targeting system, that's what I'm trying to look for. But. Well, I made it somewhere. Probably got the. Oh, I got a refill. Nice. Okay. Zero goals. I end up hitting, hitting these guys right. Some hits now, guys. We're getting progress. Okay. All right. 
Alright, so far so good. Set right there. I ran out of ammo. Not a good thing either. I need to payload a refuel. I do get ammo, just can't use it. Hmm. Alright, maybe I'll get a refill, guys. Hopefully, I can do it. Yeah, see, it's pretty cool though. Scrap the gunship, all right. It's like, shoot the gunship, shoot it. His audio's a little unique. I even lowered the effects on the jet there, so I'm on the whites, pure jet guys. Guess you gotta feel the realism. Yeah, I completed it with losing my life. Wow, I lucked out. Gotta try again. All right, give me one more shot. Far so good. Give me some bonus. All right. Crunched. It's crunch time, my friends. the bonus.
I guess he's in our team, because he ain't even so good shot. All right, cool, he's, a, he's our co-pilot, nice. Man, I thought he was our enemy jet. <laughs> We get to the volcano, Sarge, and we'll do so. <clears throat> Mission objective. <laughs> oh, yeah. You got the need for speed. Yeah. Woo. That's hot. Now that's fresh. Time for a refill. All right, guys, refill my jet. I feel the need, the blazing speed. Where's the main objective? Thank you very much. That guy. Who's next on the playing field? Slow down, what's going on here? What's going on? Bam! Bam! All right, cool. We're holding up. We're holding up a little bit better. After the third or fourth attempt, we are doing good, guys. So. Two more goals. Scrap the gunship. Object to complete. Oh yeah. It's flying glory. 
is going to clean up the rest of these guys. So he took out the good shit. So where's my next f home flight? Am I going to make it smoothly to helm or am I going to get shot at again? All right. Just taking a cruise. A flight cruise, if you will. Scrambled. Yep, I need energy now. Hold on, buddy. We're either gonna make it to Bay or No Bay. All right. We completed the mission, guys. All right, we did good. Pretty good. So mission accomplished. Okay. All right. Let's try one more mission. Let's try mission weasel. In every group there's a weak slink in Black Falcon's weasel. He's unbalanced, attentive. And sorry, excuse for a combat ballot, but he's got prototype one. And he's nearby protecting a convoy still in order. Let's go get him. Man, I'm still poor. Apparently, I can't afford a nice upgrade. I have destroyed three convoys, five radar dishes, and weasel. All right, let's see if we can do it. Wow, there's a lot of things you gotta work on this game. A little bit of details here and there, but... Oh, there's no forgiveness, huh? Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, okay. I see what's good to happen. Convoys are there. Hmm. 
Alright, where's everybody at? Where's this Ben Weasel guy we're gonna mess with? Actually, Ben Weasel's a cool guy, and it's a, uh, you know, Weasel. Where's the wheeze? much with one life so we're gonna be seeing more of me now that could only be a good thing it's about time to sound the fixed balance out with the music Mind. I spoke too soon. Now the jet and the music are becoming one living rift. Hey, there's land support. Didn't know that. The fastest land support ever, faster than the NASCAR group whenever they use a symbol of the car. Even a lucky extra life would help at this point. Get me some power. what I need. Get some relief. Oh, that's solo, man. Can't go wrong. Enemy lock on. I don't know who that was, but it was a special guest, apparently. Killing me, man. I only got one life, boss. Let me slide. Let this old pilot slide. Yeah, 
Yep, and that was the end of my flight. All right, so as far as Afterburner Black Falcon's concerned, okay, so like one one mission a couple, took me a couple of tries, and I won the lost the second one. So, so as far as my reviews, I think this was a pretty cool game. It was a PSP game. I'm sure it probably would have been a lot more easier to play on the PSP. So. Trying to program it as best I could, I had to get it. I had to, it took me a while to get a hold of the, get the hang of the controlling. The controlling was, it was, it wasn't that hard. It was just a matter of getting into it and kind of figuring out the buttons here and there, and finally getting a rhythm. After that fourth attempt, I was able to get that rhythm going. So controlling wise, I give the control a seven, just because it's not uh, probably emulated properly for certain controls. As far as the music, I like the music. It was pretty cool. It's pretty, pretty eighties, pretty jet. It just kind of at times melted with the sound effects, and then you end up getting a riff made of missiles, missile shots, and gunfire. Uh, the music gets an eight. The graphics, graphics were pretty cool. They're three D graphics. Give them like a like an eight as well. The storyline, it's pretty straightforward. Pretty straightforward storyline. You're out to recapture the assassins, Black Falcon, take on the, you know, go after the betrayal, of, you know, the, the boss that betrayed you and trained you, or the general that trained you and became a traitor, and his girlfriend. So that's a unique 80s style plot, 90s style plot. So I give it an eight because I like 90s cheesy plots, or some 80s cheesy plots. Um, the overall so yeah you know what i recommend the game i recommend going for afterburner black falcon yeah, maybe i just gotta give it a couple of more tries maybe i could play a little more and maybe i might just be able to beat it but it's probably something i won't be focusing on but i wanted to go ahead and give it a shot and yeah, pretty much that's my review of afterburner black falcon for the psp all right so once again thanks a lot guys for joining me once again in this awesome adventure that we had today and playing Afterburner Black Falcon. It was fun. It was exciting. You know, try to bring a little bit of a little bit of everything in these times, man. I think we all need a little bit of a relief, even if it wasn't the best plane ever. It wasn't actually that good at the game. It was my first time, so it's kind of like you know, just like every other game, we don't become number one or start being the best the first time we got it. First time it got around, it takes many many times. Uh, thank you all for hanging out, watching my videos, you know, subscribing, hanging out, and also hanging out on Twitch too. So if you ever catch me on Twitch, say hello, drop by, chill, have fun. I also play a lot of other abstract or classic or some new games. But for the moment, you know, stay home, stay safe. Hopefully once the salt passes, we'll be able to hang out go out more and you know, just enjoy everyday life like it should be but for the moment at this point in time guys I'll catch you all on the flip side you have a good evening out there and stay safe Daddy.